Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Crosshair just dropped a surprise. It's brand new AI workstation 300 powered by AMD Ryzen AI Max series. Compact design, crazy specs and a starting price of $1599. But can this mini PC slash workstation finally rival HP or other? Let's break it down. Before that, make sure to subscribe. I am so close to 400 subs. Give me the test of 500 subs, please. Okay. Crosshair has officially announced the AI Workstation 300. It almost like a mini PC that uses AMD's new Strikeholo platform. It was first spotted during AMD's AI announcement for their 128B parameter LLM driver update. Now it is live on Crosshair side available for pre-order. Let's talk about the specs. Crosshair is launching three main versions. First base model. For $1599, you are getting Ryzen AI Max 385 CPU. AMD Radeon 8050S i GPU up to 48GB VRAM, 64GB LPDDR5X RAM and 1TB M2 NVMe SSD. In the mid model, for $1999, you are getting Ryzen AI Max Plus 395 CPU, AMD Radeon 8060S i GPU up to 96GB VRAM, 128GB LPDDR5X RAM and 1 terabyte, 1 terabyte M.2 NVMe SSD. In simple terms, for the extra boost, you need to pay extra dollars. And for the top model, for $2,299, you are getting the same specs as the middle model. But for that extra $300, you are getting 4 terabyte of SSD with 2 terabyte each. As for the size, it is 247.55 mm in length, 188.44 mm in wide. It has built in 350 watt power supply. And if we talk about the other features, it supports XDNA2 NPU with up to 50 tops of AI acceleration, advanced dual fan cooling for optimal thermal performance, access powerful AI tools with the Crosshair AI software suite. And you are also getting 2 years of warranty. If we talk about the ports, in front it has 1 USB 4 type C port, 2 USB 3.2 Gen 2 type A ports, and in the back 2 USB 2 type A ports, 1 HDMI, 1 DP. 1 USB 4 type C port and 1 USB 3.2 Gen 2 type A ports. And it also has an Ethernet port, obviously. For the full details, I'm going to give you official link so you can do your own research. Pre order are open now. Expected shipping might start between September 8 to 15. When compared to HP's Gen 2 workstation, which started around $3,000, Crosshair pricing could give it a big advantage and strong chance to capture the significant share of the market. Honestly, I think Crosshair is going in the right direction here. For $1,599, you are getting 64GB of VRAM, a strong Ryzen AI Max chip and compact design that perfect for both workloads and professional users. But I also think the 2000 for the 395 models is both exciting and questionable. 128GB RAM at this price is rare. But integrated GPU might still limit certain workloads like heavy 3D rendering or high-end gaming. Still, for workstation, this could be a big win. So what do you think about Crosshair new AI Workstation 300? Is this real HP J2 killer or is it just another overpriced mini PC? Drop your thoughts in the comment and if you enjoy a quick update on new PC hardware, make sure to like, subscribe for more news just like this. I will see you tomorrow. Thank you.